Let's get it over to Emily Skydeman now for a look at that weekend forecast. The weather thankfully will cooperate if you have any plans outside for Saturday and Easter Sunday. Even the early part of next week looks dry and it looks fairly mild. Then the middle part of next week is when things start to take a turn. Here's a view outside all across West Michigan where we have mostly sunny conditions. Grand Rapids has blue skies overhead, more of the same in Muskegon. And in Holland, you really can't even see a cloud overhead. So it's nice and dry out there right now with a lot of sunshine too. StormTrack Live shows that really well. Satellite imagery and radar is turned on here and there's really not too much to see. We have that area of high pressure down to our south and that's the reason that we're seeing these quiet, calm conditions. This is gradually going to meander out of the region. So we'll keep mostly sunny conditions with us for most of the day tomorrow. And it looks like Sunday we'll have mostly sunny skies as well. So here's the big picture regional view of Futurecast if you're going to be anywhere across the Great Lakes region through the weekend. Today, the rest of the day will feature quiet, dry weather. Now tonight, we do have a chance of seeing those clouds thicken up just a little bit. I think a lot of that will be high cloud coverage, but still, we'll start off your Saturday with a little bit more cloud cover, and actually areas off to our northeast could see a brief rain shower. For us in West Michigan, just a little bit of cloud cover to start the morning tomorrow, and I think by the afternoon we'll see mostly sunny skies once again. Clear conditions in the forecast going into Easter Sunday, maybe a little bit more high cloud coverage overhead by Sunday afternoon, but again, dry conditions are in the forecast. Now our high temperatures going forward keep climbing over the next couple of days. High temperatures this afternoon, mid 40s. That's a little bit cooler than average. Saturday, upper 50s. Sunday, upper 60s. And by Monday, I think we have a good chance of making it close to, uh, uh, to 70 degrees. Next week, our temperatures return to the 60s and we'll have a few more rain chances in there as well. So overall, not looking bad this weekend. The one thing that I think might become a bit of a hindrance tomorrow will be the wind speeds. Our winds will start to increase slightly tonight. By 6 a.m. tomorrow, winds will be sustained around 10 to 15 miles per hour. Now notice they're coming in from the south. So we're drawing in that warmer air that helps our temperatures out. But by tomorrow afternoon, we could see sustained winds close to 20 miles per hour. It's still fairly dry outside and we're expecting dew points to only end up in the teens to low 20s on Saturday. So that combined with the high wind speeds means it's not going to be a good day to burn anything if you had any yard work or anything like that to do. Wind speeds will calm down by Easter Sunday and here's your Easter Sunday forecast. Upper 60s, winds around five miles per hour and at least hazy sunshine expected. Enjoy the sunshine over the next couple of days. Enjoy that 70 on Monday. After that, we start to see that pattern shift just a bit. So we'll keep watching that forecast for next week. Looks like we have several chances of on again, off again rain showers, and our temperatures will be back in the 50s and 60s. Now, I predicted earlier this week before you were here, Emily, that we were going to hit 70 on Sunday. You know, we're, we're pretty close. Closer. And I wouldn't be surprised, especially around 94, some of those inland areas, if we can squeak out a little bit more sunshine, Ooh. I think some spots definitely could get there. So nice. not a bad Easter. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Emily.